So today we're back once again to take a look at the best memes and artwork the Terraria community has to offer. So let's jump into it. So welcome back everyone. Committed a little thing, mostly out of boredom. Is this really him? Yes. And you will rebuild his body. Yeah. Have you read the Terraria lore? It's kind of graphic. Essentially, the mechanic kind of mashed a bunch of stuff together. And that's how we got the Moon Lord. I know, uh, you wouldn't think it. Very simple game with bunnies, right? Anyone who plays multiplayer can relate. After all, why not? Why shouldn't I keep it? Yeah, I'm like this. I'm like this quite a bit. And I feel bad about it because usually I've got more hours in Terraria than the people I'm playing with. So I'm like, well, really I should give the life crystal to them, but I don't. I like to keep it. <laughs> I like to be like Bilbo in this situation. Terraria items that you never used. Start a pack. Okay, there's a lot of items in Terraria. This is bound to happen. Let's see which one I, I disagree with the most. Because there'll be something on here that I will probably use. Yeah, I've already found it. It's Shuriken. I like using Shuriken. I'll even buy Shuriken. I used to do it all the time in my Let's Plays. Uh, but I feel like most people would, would probably agree with this. Unless you're a builder. If you're a builder, you've used all of these items. The final, 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 final update. And that's the way I like it. This is the final update. Wow. All right. Which one? <laughs> Relogic. This is the seventh week in a row that you've shown the final update. Yeah, they're getting a bit of a record for it, but I love them because of it. Happy Halloween. All right. We might be a little bit late to this. But here is a pretty amazing looking Halloween themed build. So this is by Lady Forestina, I think. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it is. All right. I recognize the style. So the cool thing about her is that she actually builds on console, I believe. So I want to know, has she converted to keyboard and mouse? Because if I was a builder, I couldn't use a control pad. I feel like it would drive me mad. Trying to advertise mods to vanilla players. You're invited to suffer. Okay. And with the masochist mode icon, I've, I've felt that pain, all right? I'm clicking join every time. If you are a vanilla player and you've yet to try mods, but you have a PC that's capable of it, leave me a comment down below. Why haven't you checked out mods? Because they really are fantastic. Like, this looks like you're gonna be put through torture, but it'll be the best torture you've ever had in Terraria. Boss tier list based on master mode difficulty. So to acknowledge it really quick, I did make my own boss tier list after the last Reddit video. And it's quite funny reading the responses because some people either really agree or really disagree. So it's interesting seeing that like duality in the comments. So what did they put? Moon Lord is hell. Okay, disagree with that. Uh, Empress of Light, Duke and Queen is requires practice. I can get that. I think some people were kind of upset that I didn't bump the, the Queen slime up higher. Mildly difficult, the twins and Skeletron. Mediocre, Plantera, really? Okay. Might have been wrong about Plantera for some people. Easy attack pattern for Queen Bee. Disagree. I think that's where most people disagree with me. A lot of people find Queen Bee easy, and I get that, right? Homunculus. <laughs> it's the golem. You know what? Not a bad list. Honestly, not a bad list at all. Made pumpkin out of pipe cleaners. All right, a little bit of a late post again, but let's check it out. I already love it. Oh, okay. That is really cool. Oh my God. How did you, how'd you do that? Like, how do people get so talented with pipe cleaners? I feel like when they used to bust these out in like arts class, I was terrible at them, right? I would make a snake, because <laughs> all I can do. I even love the, the cape, the cape is amazing. Terraria items you want, but don't have the patience to grind for. <laughs> I already like the concept, because that is so true. It's true for a lot of items in Terraria, and most specifically for me, cell phone, Terra Spark boots. I never make either in my Let's Plays, and people always ask about it. So what did they put? Reaver Shark. I don't agree with that, all right? Not after the 1.4 change. These as well. I always make these before my Moon Lord fight, so I have to disagree. I agree with this. I definitely agree with the Ank Shield. I never make food. I, I just never make any food. Portal Cube, I get that. Zappinator. I guess, yeah, it is kind of a grind. It's kind of like RNG with the Traveling Merchant. Uh... Terra Prisma, disagree. I will get the Terra Prisma every time. I love the grind for that. Rainbow Cursor, oh, that's a good one. So that's my item, or it's like my inspired item. And it's a 5% drop chance from the Empress of Light. It's, 
It's kind of one of the rarest items in the game at this point. I feel like it's hard to, to tell what's really rare or not, but it's rare. I got it first time though the other day. It was like, it was kind of amazing. Bam. So, oh, the Rod of Discord though is, no, that is the biggest offender. I want it in every Let's Play, never get it. I had it in one Let's Play and it was the best ever. Hi, I'm the guide. Ask me anything. Okay, all right. This could be a very interesting post. Let's, let's, let's read a couple of comments and see if we can get any gems out of it. What's the funniest way you've seen your protégés die? Do you keep a scorecard? I already saw one die to a single bee. It was so funny. I let a zombie and he's in the house. <laughs> All right, this is very guide behavior. Why do you do this? Bunnies exist. The player, you, without reason. <laughs> okay, get in. All right, I don't know what you're talking about. I've never been guilty of a thing like this. Oh yeah, <laughs> that's it. Oh my God, it's class. What's wrong with the raven description? Uh, never, ah, oh, that's clever. I never knew that was in the game. That's quite cool. It's a reference to, is it Edgar Allan Poe? Maybe. All I'm thinking of is Treehouse of Horror. I'll be honest with you, all right? Whenever I read Nevermore, I hear it in that one voice line. Nevermore. How do you pronounce Terraria? Just curious about how people say Terraria. Terraria, Terraria, other, okay. This is my way of saying it, okay? I vote. Oh, <laughs> I'm in the minority, never mind. Fixed up my first animated 3D crafting station. Had to take some creative liberties and change the sprite a bit to match the 3D style. Hope you like it. Oh, they're back again. The auto hammer. What happens when it hits the top? Oh, very satisfying. Look at that. Turning chlorophyte to shroomite. Very nice. You need to match up with the people that make Terraria craft, all right? You two could make amazing things. This would be like the best crossover you've ever seen. For those of you who saw me die to the Moon Lord in the last few seconds on my previous Master Mode Hardcore run, I've done it. I've beaten the game on Master Mode Hardcore as pure melee, all right? We take our hat off to you, sir. Okay, let me see these moments. I want to see how you did it, all right? Okay, so it's a pretty big accomplishment. Master Mode Hardcore? Hell yeah. So this is good. They've actually gone in very prepared. What is that sprite? What is that? What? <laughs> Why? <laughs> Why this sprite? Why that? Um, you know what? I hope you die on your next run, all right? <laughs> For that cursed content. Copper Golem bought... Hey, I like this. So this is a little bit of a riff on the uh, the Minecraft mob that, that never made it. Sorry about that. I voted for somebody else. <laughs> that's a great sprite. That should be a, a full texture pack for sure. Right, so that's it for today's Reddit video. Thank you so much for watching. Leave the video a big fat thumbs up and consider subscribing if you really loved it. See you in the next one. Peace.